So I would usually set about three alarms the night before and usually by the second one I'm up. Um, I don't get out of bed, you know, I stay in bed just like we all do for a few minutes, but I will usually be awake by this time. And I think this time is a good opportunity as you're awake and you're just laying down there to remember to make the du'a of waking up. Um, I've also recently started doing my gratitude journal early in the mornings just because I think it's a really good time to do it and to start the day off on a positive note. So I would write the five things that I am grateful to Allah for. It can be tricky to think of new things every day but I do try to think of new ones um, every day although some do repeat themselves. After my gratitude journaling, I would usually get up and make my bed right away and then make my way into the bathroom to prepare for Salah. It is important to remember to make dua before entering into the bathroom and also to practice the sunnah of entering the bathroom with your left foot first. So once I'm in the bathroom, I will brush my teeth as we all do and also use some mouthwash. After that, I will proceed to getting into the shower and having a quick shower just before I pray my salah. I would then go and make wudu and then leave the bathroom following the sunnah again of leaving with your right foot and also making the dua of leaving the bathroom. So after my salah, I go straight into the kitchen and start preparing my breakfast. I don't usually have anything special. Most days I have toast or some kind of a sandwich, usually on my way to work in a rush. But on a good day, I can at least sit down for a few minutes and have my breakfast at home. And on this day, I am having some cornflakes. I don't usually like cold milk with my cornflakes in the morning. I'm weird like that. So I will pour my milk into a cup and warm it up before I pour it into with my cornflakes and add some milk and yeah like nothing fancy just a quick and easy breakfast So I would usually bring in my breakfast with me and sit down and have my breakfast whilst watching a couple of YouTube videos. They could be Islamic reminders or motivational talks or, you know, just vlogs or whatever. Today I'm just watching a couple of vlogs and a couple of routine videos as well, funny enough. Um, so yeah, it's just whatever I'm really feeling for that about five, ten minutes that I'm sitting down having my breakfast for. So once I've had my breakfast, I come back to my desk and then do my morning um, beauty routine, if you like. I'm definitely not a makeup person. People know me at work most of the time. I come as my face is bare faced, and if I'm doing the most, I might wear an eyeliner. But today I'm just literally moisturizing my face and applying my toner as I normally do and moisturizing my lips. And that is pretty much all that I do. If you want to know about my skincare routine, I have a video on that. I will leave it linked in the description box down below. Brothers and sisters. 
sisters of the world and all humanity. There is a lady that we adore, the mother of believers, the special one. Oh, Aisha, Aisha, ready Allah, Anha, Aisha, Aisha, ready Allah, Anha. She was the wife of Muhammad. Peace be upon him. We love him so much. Our amazing father was Abu Bakr. Radiallahu anhu, known as the truthful one. Aisha, Aisha, radiallahu. My uniform, and when I say uniform, it's just a uniform I have selected for myself. Um, would usually be an abaya with some kind of a cardigan, or I would wear a maxi skirt some kind of a top and a cardigan or a jacket something like that thrown on top she was the first woman scholar of our islam yeah she was a man the greatest giver of hadith She was a mother Aisha, Aisha, Rabi Allah Anha Aisha, Aisha, Rabi Allah Anha And this is my outfit for today I love this shirt, it's from um, it's not a shirt, it's kind of like a blouse really um, it's from H&M and just for a little bit more coverage and just because it's still quite cold in England so I would usually throw a scarf over myself and then yeah this is me so just before I leave as I'm putting my shoes on I will again make sure to make the water before leaving the house i know it sounds like a lot guys but honestly once you get yourself into the routine of it you just don't even notice how you sort of implement these sunnas as you go about your daily um, routine so yes i will make the dua before leaving the house and finally i will leave the house on my way to work to face the busyness of the day and the annoyingness of my travel <laughs> so yes guys that is my morning routine i hope you guys have enjoyed it i hope you will practice some of the sunnas that i have recommended in this video um, if you like this video please make sure to give me a thumbs up share it with your families and friends and encourage other sisters to also practice the sunnas here Jazakallah hey guys for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh.